Hello, we are live. Here we go, we are live. Hello, everybody. What's going on? It's Levi Taurus and Caster Holland that way. How you doing, guys? It's me. And I've got some hats. He's got the hats. He's got the hats, everybody. Ben, how you doing, my man? Mel, what is up? Well, she asked us that. She said, hey, guys, what's up? <laughs> Straight back at you. Coming at you from Chugmas land and uh, your lounge. You're actually in the North Pole, aren't you? I am. Leaving. Yeah, I'm, I'm meeting up with Scranta. Um, yeah. Uh, we've got an appointment tomorrow to talk about what we can do next year for Chugmas. Um Blimey, the comments coming in thick and fast. Merry Christmas, peace from Hungary. I hope you're not hungry this Christmas. Uh, I'm good, bro. He says, Ben, I hope you've had a good day. I've had a, I've had a great day. I woke up this morning and my throat felt like a cheese grater. I've got the the Jugmas flu, I believe. Um, but, you know, I, I did. I was sort of like, oh, should we do the stream? But you know what? It's Chugmas. We're going to power through, right, Caster? Right, and I hope everyone <laughs> has, has, you know, taken your sob story into into their hearts this Christmas and appreciates the uh, the the, char the charitable work you're going you're doing right now. You what know? can I say? What can I say? The it's got to be done. We've got to do this live stream, otherwise and elves be, die. And you're not being paid extra because it's Christmas either, are you? So no, no. And no bank money. holiday pay. Let it rubbish in. Oh. It's not even a bank holiday. Uh, a lot of people are still working. In fact, people work over Christmas. How about that? People, do you work over Christmas, Caster? I will be working on demolishing um, an unfortunate turkey. Oh, I'll be working on this for in terms of working for a living. Uh, I won't be. I was talking about, okay, good. Well, that's good to know. You work in New Year's? Not New Year's Day, but New Year's Eve, probably. Yeah. Um, well, at least you got the two big of a, ones off. Not much of a party animal anyway, so I'll be all right. Caitlin, this is the first Christmas in eight years. She's had Boxing Day off. Wow, how generous. That is quite generous. What's she doing with Boxing Day? What do you do? What is Boxing Day? It's to um, it's so the Queen, God rest her soul, could say thank you to all her um, her <laughs> slaves that she's uh, made That's a cup of Christmas dinner. What have you got there? I'm lighting a scented candle, mate. Oh, we're living the the chugmas life here. Oh, me. Um, okay. Uh, let's, let's get some people in. Um, share the stream. You know we're going to be live for a little bit. We're not going to we're not going to be up until midnight or anything. We, we're going to be doing this for as long as we feel happy to do this for. Um, so you know, share this share that share this chunk of a stream with your friends. We've got things to talk about. We've got updates. We've got exciting things. Uh, well, really, we've got teasers of exciting things. But you know, you guys get to be the first to be teased. So uh, there you go. Caitlin's going to eat the leftover Christmas dinner, chill out, and probably just stay in PJs all day. That's the Chugmas spirit. Next line. What, are you merch, be doing, right? candles. what am I going to be doing um, on Boxing Day or just Christmas in general? Let's let's put it let's put it both. You know what are you doing Christmas Day and Boxing Day. Christmas Day. It's a nice, simple Christmas Day. We, uh, we, we, we just chill. Family time, you know. Oh dear, this isn't going to look good, is it? If I set fire to myself on stream. <laughs> <laughs> go on. This is where we can test the masks. <laughs> Let's go. Fuck me. That was a close one, wasn't it? <laughs> that was very good. Right. <laughs> Sorry Will there be a new Chugmas song tonight? No. 
mini bang 10 i'm really sorry there won't be there's no new chugmas song this year the chugmas celebrations uh we put we put on a show in bridgewater the lovely bridgewater where we always end up going and uh you know we had a we had a very good time we if you want to see the shenanigans go check out the instagram we uploaded a video and uh yeah so i'm sorry you missed out it was a free show lots of people came and it was it was good fun it was good fun it's um, good, man. There, there is no new chugma show I, how do we feel about the uh, the chugma show caster yeah i had a great time um getting back to manchester the day after not so great yeah um horrible horrible night no sleep but it's rock and roll isn't it rock you know? and roll um <laughs> it is it is hard like one-off shows like that are quite hard because if you at least if you're on the road you can like just stop somewhere and sleep whereas you have to get home from work the next day like it's hard it's hard especially when you don't get in till quarter to six in the morning yeah. what was yeah. that madness anyway the show was great everyone had a really lovely cold time because it was uh it was when the temperatures went below Below zero, yeah, all the time. Minus, yeah. minus three ish, I think it was. Which was a perfect, perfect temperature for us to play in, wasn't it? It's I so felt good. right. Yeah, they left the door open as well. There was no heating on. They left the door wide open. Yeah, it was. Well, it was not, mate, it's a free one. show, mate. They can't afford. They can't afford to heat a whole room no. of you know at least a couple of thousand chuggalos. Um <laughs> Not fueled by uh, not fueled by beer alone. Come on, man! No, no, yeah, can't got to have you know tickets on the door for for that. Yeah, uh, there is a lot more on Patreon, is what Ben's saying. We'll get onto Patreon. We've got we've got some stuff to say about about the Patreon, but um, Vic says she's sorry she missed the Bridgewater show. It's okay, you are forgiven. Well, hold on, the chat's moving too fast. Um, yeah, it's okay. You are forgiven for missing the the, the Bridgewater show. We'll be that's, back, I'm sure. She's come to our London shows. She's come to our Manchester shows. She's forgiven. You know, you are absolutely forgiven. We know who you are. Um, that sounded a little creepy. Not in a Liam Neeson <laughs> kind of way or any other. That you're all right. Shy, shy, shy. Tbh says this is making me so happy. That's good. Oh, good. That's I hope it's want. making you warm. There's a fireplace. There's a Christmas tree. There's a hat. What more do you want? This is as Christmassy as it gets. Um, <laughs> um, I don't know. Oh, okay. Fran, this is she's talking about the Christmas show. Fucking Graham wouldn't turn the heat on. He wasn't even there. He was in he his wasn't... own, you know, heated how you know house. I just maybe. Unless he Hashtag lives at the no um, heating Graham, followed by no. I don't know who he is, but I made it clear I wasn't his friend. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> no, we uh, love Graham. Amy's saying headbands makes up for the lack of Christmas decor. Mind. Hey, come on! Like I've, the rest of my house looks spectacular. Just, I'm sorry I don't have a fake background like Levi. Um. Liz. King of Zoom backgrounds. <laughs> Where did you download that one from? Oh, I literally, good. it's it's from a page that says 10 Christmas Zoom backgrounds for a Holly Jolly video chat. And this is this is a Holly Jolly video chat, isn't it? It absolutely is. It is Holly and it's Jolly. Um, <laughs> nice. I, what was your opinions of the show, mate? We've not... We've yeah, not... Yeah. The show, the show was great, man. It was uh, we, we learned some lessons from the Death Pledge um, album launch show. You know, we actually took some breaks. That. Yeah, we took some breaks. We had some pauses in the set. It was some well, some much needed pauses. Because I'll tell you what, the Death Pledge album release show, whilst it was a banger, we didn't half die. We died. We actually we died. died. We yeah. are now undead. Um, yeah, no, it was, I mean, who'd have thought actually breathing between songs was probably a good idea. So, uh, we did that 
and it was good. And because it was minus three, we weren't absolutely roasting on stage. So true. Yeah. Correct. Yeah. Correct. Um, what else have we got then? Uh, we've got we've got a thing that it says here. Yesterday, we had. I need to say this right because the stat is confusing. We you had, cannot be spreading fake news. No, we are absolutely anti-fake news here on Chugaboom TV. Um, we had more unique daily listeners yesterday than any other day in Chugaboom history on specifically Spotify. And what does that mean? What does unique listeners mean to someone who, who doesn't check the Spotify eyes page every hour to see how many more pennies we've, we've earned? It means more juggalos from around the UK, the UK, around the world, listened to us than any other day. We had more ch more different individual chuggalos listen to us yesterday. Well, you've explained that horribly, day. and well done. Um, <laughs> <laughs> um, what unique listeners means? Is that people that have never listened to us before? No, no. It's it's. It I've just explained means it horribly too. Individual people. It's just it, one unique listener is an individual person that has listened to us. Everyone's unique, and that's what's beautiful about Spotify, you know? <laughs> I mean, unique listener is a universal term, but, um, you know, yeah, anyway, more chuggalos. It means that we haven't paid people to listen to our music. Yes, no bots here. No bots. Mind you, mind you they could st the listeners still could be fake. There is nothing to say they're not fake listeners, but they are at least unique fake listeners. My hands look massive there, don't they? Ooh. You got that fisheye lens going on? Not really. It's just my selfie camera because I can't afford a um, uh, a webcam, so no. I'm on my phone. No. Um, can we get can we get me uh, a webcam on the band, please? <laughs> uh, we, once we once we've replaced my gaming laptop, can that be a? Uh, Oh, the gaming laptop's on expenses now, is it? Yeah, man. All oh, right, okay, yeah. Yeah, I see how it is. Going to get a, a VR headset next. Fuck me. Absolute uh, liberties. <laughs> Vic says, Death Pledge is on my top 22 albums of the year for 2022. Where is it in that list of 22? That's what we want I'm just happy that it's there. You know, 22 is, is it's a large number and there's lots of albums that could be above us in that list, but we're there. To be honest, I'd be hard pushed to tell you 22 bands. I, I don't think I've listened to 22 different songs this year. I, 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 I play the same ones over and over again because... I don't like change. No, I get it. I get it. I absolutely get it. Um, Joe says buy merch for Caster. Um, get your webcam replaced. I think that was in uh, reference to. We're going to spread awareness at Download Festival next year. Right. How do we feel about this, Caster? I'm going to float this idea. I floated it on the Patreon the other day in the Discord chat. How do we feel about this? We put we're putting a call out to all the sugarlows going to download next year, and we meet up in the arena, get a massive fucking picture of us and all the sugarlows in Chugaboom merch, and we get a massive picture and we use that as a petition to get us to play download next year. If if download festival don't hear wind of this. And and foil our plans, cancel our tickets, you know, stop us from actually getting into the festival. That's a fantastic idea. Um, you know, I think I think we just I, I just think like we will be there, we will be in, we will be in the download. You know, we're not playing download. This 
<laughs> but we will be there. So we've paid to be there. <laughs> we've paid to be there. We are muggles. It's our in- right to then use it to our own, you know, advantage. Yeah. Um, charge people um, five pounds to, you know, come into our gathering. Um, maybe ten pound, twenty pound, maybe. Um, you know, corning off a little area for us unofficially. Chugger boom, two Chugga of them boom. are here. That's, and we'll we'll get a big old picture. You know, we know photographers; they're probably going download. We'll get them to take a picture. Um, and yeah, I think I think we use it to, as a petition um, for not playing at least the dog to the stage in twenty four. I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna kick kick something. Not with that attitude, you won't be. <laughs> um, no so violence yeah. is allowed. That's my pitch. Uh, we'll see. We'll, 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 you know, we'll, we'll see. We'll see what transpires. But we will be there. I think if we organise this, I think it could do something. Yeah, man. If 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 there's enough people there that know who we are, um, it might do something. I mean, all I mean, we were there this year, and we were just like, right, let's go for a chugaboo merch watch and just sort of make a make a, a mental tally of the amount of people wearing chugaboo merch. And there was more than I thought there would be. To be fair, I mean, I would have just said that I was looking. Yeah, you know, I was keeping my eye. Out. I wasn't actively going out hunting people down. I'm not. I'm not that sad. No. Um, and there's too many things going on at Download for me to have done that. But I did see a couple of people. Um, paid them the compliment of, you know, nice shirt. So there you go. If somebody if somebody complimented you on your Chuggaboo merch at Download this year, that could have been Caster. It could have been, or it could have been just another 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 Chugaloo. guy. It could have been another Chuggaloo. Who knows? With a, a, a thick Boltonian accent. There you go. Um, Corvus the Vamp has a question. I love your music. And look! Thanks. One question. Is Ohanami's family about mental health issues? Ohanami's family is not really about mental health issues. It's about... um, What's it about? It's about a guy who dies, signs signs a deal with the devil, comes back to life... Uh, but he thinks he comes back to life, but actually he's come back as a ghost. Oh no, what a mistake. That's what it's about. It's fucking nonsense. Um, however, if it helps you get through whatever times you're going through, I will absolutely, uh, you you know, do you do you. Death Pledge, the song Death Pledge is about mental health issues. So if you're looking for a song about mental health issues, that's the one to go to. Fact. There you go. And that's a fact. Um, it's based on the film Ghost, be honest. Yes. Um, so when are we coming to Germany? We've got plans. Vera, we've got plans, okay? She's in the UK uh, every other week, isn't she? <laughs> I think so, yeah. I think, uh, yeah. Seeing a, yeah. Seeing a fella in a, in a sleep at the helm. There you go. So d- d- we don't need to go. We don't need you. You can you can bring Germany to us. That's fine. You've got that sorted. Um, no, we don't. We are with any luck. Fingers crossed. No promises, but knock on wood. My desk is made of wood. We are going to Europe next year. Yeah, man. God damn it, we fucking okay. It didn't happen in twenty twenty one. Didn't happen in twenty twenty two. I mean, I went to I went to Europe in twenty twenty two. I went to France, but that was on holiday. Um, I think the last time I went into mainland Europe, it was to see Ice Nine Kills, Papa Roach and Hollywood of the Dead in Austria. Um, And that was before COVID. Was it before COVID or was it in the middle of COVID? I don't think it would have been in the middle, man. I think it would have been before... I can't picture you being okay with flying to another country 
during COVID. No, you're probably right. Yeah, let's be realistic. Right. <laughs> it was it was good fun though. It was it was good fun. Um, but that was the last time. That was the last time I went to, to mainland Europe. So it, it, I think we're due. I think we're way past due at this point. And um, you know, let's make it happen. Uh, so yes, we will be coming to Germany at some point next year. With any luck. Well, what's everyone else saying? Uh, what's everyone else doing? What 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 have they got on the Christmas list? Yeah, what's on the Christmas list, Chuggalos? Come on. Um, when's the collaboration with the Zebra the Helm happening? Never, they're too good for us. I think so. I think they're a bit too heavy. I think they scare Avera with the, they the... scare Avera. Yeah, man. <laughs> I don't Yeah, too many um heavy riffs for, for Avera, I'm afraid. Um that was the beginning of 2020. There you go, confirmed. Uh, Austria in 2020. That was uh, that was that was when I last went. New Chuggaboo merch, obviously. Still got a big as the shop to do tonight. Oh fucking hell! Um, what are you gonna get? It's it's so late in the day. Are you gonna get? Are you gonna get some tiny pretzels? Um, they're good. There are little cheese twists, pastry, pastry cheese twist things. They're good. They're a good Christmas snack. What's a good Christmas snack, Levi? Okay, you can't go wrong with crackers and cheese, man. You can if you're lactose intolerant. Wow, we got the vegan cheese, so you can definitely go wrong with vegan cheese. Then I'm afraid <laughs> I'm calling. I'm calling that one out. <laughs> Um, and then you can probably get some very, very good vegan cheese. Um, but I'm afraid the experience that I had with Levi and um, <laughs> Leo when they were the making story. vegan, the vegan cheese the sandwich gate, vegan cheese sandwich gate. Um, was it Via Life? No, Via is, that... is not. Via Life is not smelling. It was. I think it was Apparines. I think is what the the brand is. Apparines. Apple green, I think. Let me check. Fuck apple greens. I'm calling them out. No, apple green yes, yes. leave is a petrol station. What's it called? Apple. It's apple something, I'm pretty sure. Apple stinks like fucking death. That's what its name apple should be. Wood. It's called apple wood. Yeah, man. It was the smell of this vegan cheese in the van. Um, they were making plenty of sandwiches on the go so you know getting the spread buttering it in the hands while in the van like animals um i was it was it was it, i could i could chew the smell is how bad it was um and it and it brought a tear to my eye um it is a so, it is highly vegan cheese you can absolutely I can, you'll, you can have that one in very, very smelly. Thank you um, very much. But yeah. then this guy, I mean, and we wrote it in the song The Hatred. Who ate my fucking sandwich? I've been complaining about it. I've been complaining about fucking cheese. I, no, no, I think, I think I had a bit of the bread. No, mate. You had my fucking sandwich. Did I? Yep. After all this. That's After an actual all, fact, man. and it's not just like you got desperate for some lyrics. No, mate, I was in the van writing the lyrics. And I ate your <laughs> fucking sandwich. You ate my fucking sandwich. Oh, my God. I must have I been like, hungry. where the fuck is my sandwich? Fucking Leo made me this sandwich. <laughs> You're there. Oh, oh I'm man. hungry, actually. It didn't <laughs> have your name on it. That's all it I'm going to say. My, it was in me and Leo shared a bag. <laughs> I like how this all comes out now. Like I've not, you've not mentioned it to me. Like other than <laughs> obviously writing a song about it. Um, but there is obviously some issues that we need to work through here. So let's 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 do it, man. Like I, um, I don't think I can. I don't think I can. I don't think I can apologize because I was obviously you know very hungry in that van. 
Um, I get it, man. I get it. It's fun. It's, I've, I've I'm just, since forgiven you. Thank you. Is that, is that know, after you wrote the moment. song? Is yeah, it like Taylor Swift? Way, way after I wrote the song and called you out on it, I've forgiven you. Thanks. Well, obviously the smell that made me sick wasn't enough to put me <laughs> off eating it, which says more about me than... <laughs> You ate his fucking sandwich is what Ben said. Yeah, man. Sorry. It turns out I did. Um, <laughs> Theft sandwich. Grand theft sandwich. <laughs> Fuck. Um, sorry. Yeah. Sorry, man. That's really bad because I would be very upset if someone ate my sandwich. Um, Merry Christmas to you. Keep it ill. Merry Christmas. Uh, the We Mixed Pretzels. We're going back to Christmas snacks. Yeah, the wind mixed pretzels, that's the one. Said like a true Scots Scots woman. Um, garlic bread, garlic bread. Garlic bread on Christmas Day, that would be good, wouldn't it? That would be a nice it little would treat. Good. would be good. Uh, I do, uh, you know, pigs in blank. We rate the pigs in blank. Yeah, man. Um, obviously, I don't know how vegan pigs in blankets works, but I'm sure it's kind of nice. Um are you vegan? <laughs> Me? Yeah. No. Or are you just no, lactose intolerant? Really. I, I can't have dairy. It's not, without details, it's not lactose that fucks me. It's just dairy. It seems to just be milk. I don't know. Because I've tried that lacto free milk and that still fucks me. Um, what? So, yeah. what if, if, if not lactose in that milk, what of dairy does it actually have? Like, I how. how is it actually still milk? Just like white water, I think, at that point, isn't it? <laughs> so fucking grim. Um, um, I've, I've got no idea, but I can't have dairy. Um, so I can't remember what we were talking about. Uh, you, me if I was vegan. you said, no, I'm yeah. not vegan. That's it. Yeah, man. Uh, anyway, moving on. Songs. Have we got some songs to play, people? Or... Songs. Right. So I before stream, I asked Caster to um, give me some of his favourite songs from the Chugmas Christmas Number One's album. And I also chose a few of mine. Um, I want to know, I j just to put the, put the question out there, what is your favourite one or two songs from... Christmas number ones. Um, we are excluding the first Chugmas songs from this conversation. We're just talking about the album. Um, so while while we get those, while we wait for those answers to come in, um, should we do mine or you first? I think we should do you because you are the person who probably wrote all of them. <laughs> okay, so let's do. We're gonna leave that one for last. Uh, just to say. let's do, let's do the first music video that we shot, which was creeping on ceilings. And then he let this play smoothly. It's definitely not smooth on my end, mate. I can tell you no, that. It's not smooth on my end either. <laughs> What is going on here? <laughs> are we gonna have to? Are we gonna have to just look and and, and look at s different stills from the the music video? We can do that. We can, yeah, absolutely, we can do that. We um, can look at different still pictures of the music video. This one here, we see Leo um, playing the guitar. Do you know? Do you know who you don't see in this music video? Me. We don't see. Avira, this music video. Why is why he was there, wasn't he? No, he wasn't. <laughs> was he not? No, there's only four of us around the tree. I'm trying to I'm trying to find this thing. Um, trying to find anyway, there's the... big big boy Santa. Um, Let me see if I can find a clip. that's a bit of a guitar. That's you. Um, that's gonna, Johnny. He's gonna play it muted. Dear me, that's that's me as as horrible Santa. 
Uh, that, yep, there you go. It revealed it was you this whole time. It was me can confirm I played horrible Santa. Yeah. So Avira was not on this shoot. Um, and why was that? Do we know? Do you do we know why that was? Um, I actually don't know what it was. I don't. I can't remember why he wasn't there. But I just think he didn't show up, mate. And I think we we're just like, fine. You know, yeah, it, it, fine. Looked, it looked quite good. There you are. Look at you. Look at there there I am. Um, whiskers. I had a horrible little Christmas jumper on that says uh, "Kiss me under the mistletoe" and then and then arrow, you know, whatever. Um, basically, just a big scumbag, wasn't it? Such an awful boy. Yeah. There you go. Fun fact: those tweets were not real. Let's remove this. It's it's not working. How do you fake a tweet? Old... You can fake I, tweet. I... You absolutely can, my dude. I, I, had, oh, I, I had this whole thing planned. We did test it earlier for whatever whatever reason. Now it's not working. So you know, that's the way these things go sometimes. Um... Well, let's <laughs> cut this live stream short. Uh... No, that's a bit. <laughs> but um, no, I mean that that song. That, I mean, we still play "Creepy on Ceilings" to this day. We um, we play it whether it's Chugmas or not, for whatever reason, it's a perfect second song in the set. Keeps the energy going, you know. <coughs> it is, uh, it is, it, it, yeah, it does. It, it's like after we play the first one, you just want to keep every keep the momentum going. And uh, Creeping on Ceiling seems to, seems to be the one. Uh, so what have we got? What, what, uh, what are we saying about the famous uh, favorite songs? Here we go. I don't give a fucking what's this. Very good shout. Very good shout. I don't give a fuck what, seems to um, appear quite often in people's lists. Yeah, it's not such a Christmassy one, is it? It's just, it's just one that we had lying around and you just like, fuck it, put that on. Yeah, so the, 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 the Chugmas album, right, was quite less, less just out there. It was rushed. I mean, is but, there well, any sort of normal time span to make a, a 24 track album in? 22. 22, sorry. It's okay. You forgive him. Um, lots of forgiving. Yes stream tonight uh 22 track album no there isn't a normal time frame for that sort of thing um and it certainly isn't less than a month no i mean it wasn't less than a month i truthfully there there are songs on that album that were written in like june uh i don't you know why we did them you have plenty you of time man. because it's they're not christmas season. Um, but yeah, no, it was it was quite hurriedly put together, uh, and towards the end of it, it was sort of like shit. We've actually got to like get a few more if we want to do this whole twenty-two days of Jugbus thing. Um, but it turned out all right, you know. Johnny came in clutch, in did a, a nice little a reading for us of the true the true story of Christmas. And if you hadn't haven't you know heard that, um, he does a fantastic Welsh accent. Um, a not so fantastic um, Russian accent. Um, a, 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 decent, in there. a decent hillbilly accent. I, you know, I think a lot of people might be, you know, put off us for that one, but just no, it's not, you know, it's, it is what it is. There's lots of accents um, and it's, it's all in good fun. Um, so what else we got then? We got, I don't give a fucking what's this. What's this is a fucking great shout. Um, what's this and Little Donkey? It's uh, Caster's favorite is Little Donkey. Here we go. I don't give a fucking Feed Him After Midnight. Feed Him After Midnight is my favorite. That's my personal favorite. 
Um, that's really good to play live. Um, bit it, midnight. it goes really quickly when you're playing it because it's quite fast and and it really gets the really gets the blood pumping when you're playing that one. Um, it it's just a shame that sometimes I can't keep up, but it's all right in the night. It's mm-hmm. it sounds good. Creeping on ceilings plays on repeat near Christmas. It's my number one Christmas song, says Amy. Good. Good. I'm glad you like it. We like it. We love it. Uh, The Breakdown. This is Tom Armour. The Breakdown at the end of Oswald Cobblepot. Uh, It's fucking insane. I'm just looking at his picture. Um, He's at a hot water comedy club. Um, Is he he some sort of stand-up comic? Is that what... (laughs) That's my question to you, Tom. Do you do... Have you... That's your homework. Answer that question for us. Um, th- yeah, that, that was fun. It, 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 and a lot of the songs about Christmas movies on that album, they were uh, I, it, that, they were heavily researched. I didn't just go in and, you know, just give, write a song. Willy-nilly, the lyrics didn't just appear. For, for Kevin's song, I sat down watched Home Alone with a notepad and didn't just look at a summary online. Didn't just look at a summary. Like, I genuinely watched Definitely Home Alone. didn't watch a summary. And uh, do, do you know, do you know, who will verify that? My definitely not fictitious girlfriend who had to put up with me watching Christmas movies in September. He means his mom. Basically, and I'm not saying that his mom is his girlfriend or he has any kind of relationship like that, but he doesn't have a girlfriend, and um, it's it's more likely going to be his mom that he had to watch. You know, mom, I need this living room TV for at least an hour thirty minutes. I need to bring a pad and pen. Is that okay? Yes, go ahead, son. It could be a nice bonding experience, but um, so yeah, Levi's mom can vouch for that. That did happen. So September, I was watching Home Alone with a notepad, and I watched Gremlins. I watched uh, Die Hard. I watched, which is a Christmas movie. I watched um, uh, the uh, Batman Returns, which is also a Christmas movie. Um, That's a lot of films, man. How much spare time did you have? Oh, well, it's COVID. We were in lockdown. We were in lockdown. Yeah, I, I probably I didn't have a job. Yeah, you would have just been made uh, <laughs> made just been sacked, sacked by I would COVID. Have, <laughs> I, would, I would have, I would have just written Death Pledge at that point. The song Death Pledge. Yeah, man, you, you were fucking on point. the edge, weren't you? You were, was, you, you were one fucking, you were one. I don't know, Christmas song away from um, not, writing not no being more the Christmas song anymore. Yeah, man. Um, <laughs> The darkness cover is awesome, Kevin. Um, Should we? Can we get Justin Hawkins to to listen to that? He has. We he tried has a to TikTok, get him on it. He? We tried to get him on it, but he wasn't having any. Oh fuck, sake, man. Um. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. How's the little gizmo? Still? How's the little gizmo? Melanie's just asked me about the gizmo that I was gifted at the Chugma show. We still got that. Gizmo's doing great. He's on my car keys. He's uh, he's living a good life. Have you got him wet yet? I got it. I haven't got him wet. Luckily, it was raining today, so I was a bit concerned about that. Um, the Mariah always kills me. What's this is amazing musically. So many good tracks. You seem to like the album. We like you, like in the album. Got to give Johnny's Issues a shout too. So Johnny's Issues appeared in the, the Spot of Metal Christmas playlist. Johnny's, what, remind me of Johnny's Issues again. There's so many songs. Johnny's I can't, Issues. I'm, I'm, um, I don't remember how it goes. Is it a rap? No. Yeah. Uh, no. It's Is it his rap? rap? No, his rap is is famous internally, but not. No, 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 no. Didn't he? Didn't he do? Didn't? Is that the one where like you appear on it as well, and you're like, oh, fuck off, and. 
Uh, Who are you going to play? Uh, I'm going to see if I can find it. Hold on. Johnny's issues. Hold on. It, no, it's, it's the on the seventh day of Christmas, my true love she gave to me. A bit yeah, of a no, it's a rap. Time. It's not a rap, no. Is it like got a trap beat to it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's sort of this oh, really right, shit it. rap beat. Yeah, but it's not a rap. <clears throat> okay, all right. That's that's why I'm confused. Um, my favorite song from the Christmas album is "Christmas Time." Don't be a bell end. My neck, my back, and what's this? My neck, my back. Was unfortunate um, accident on that album, but you know we we committed to that. It was what what. My neck, my back. It was a, it was an unfortunate accident of a song that ended up on that Christmas album. Well, that it, that it goes to show how desperate we were for songs at that point. Listen, man, I remember you calling me, um, asking for for different names of, um, for different versions of of, of names for 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 cock for balls, um. The just male so genitalia you can kind of, generally. Yeah, put them in this song. Um I felt I felt unclean after that conversation. Um, <laughs> well, I can tell you now, Johnny absolutely hates that cover. <laughs> like he will not even acknowledge its existence. Yeah, he doesn't it's like yeah, a, a, a leader of a country not acknowledging a certain state or you know. But yeah. That song does not exist politically to Johnny. That's exactly right. Uh, Vera says she's absolutely ready for Takedown Festival next year. Absolutely. April the 9th, if, if that's right in my head. We're playing Takedown Festival next year. That's going to be good. Who else is playing on that one? We're on the uh, Down for Live stage, aren't we, with pretty much yeah. every single band that, that are on the Down for Live management roster. Shout out to Toby yeah. and, uh, and the crew. Um, so the city's ours. Gonna see them again. We keep crossing, Lovely we keep boys. crossing paths with those boys, the good boys. Of course, we do. Of course, we do. Oh, um, who else? The slip of the helm. Um, oh, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Speaking here we... of the boy, Merry Christmas, dudes, as always. Being and then he continues involved with you guys is bother. Blessing Baba. is blessing and a curse. Here's to another year of absolute fucking nonsense. And that is it. That's what it's all about. That's what we're here to do. We're here to spread absolute nonsense across the world. And you have to be okay with it. <coughs> um, yeah. Loads Very sleep Christmas token. To you too. Yeah. And I'd love and sleep token. Yeah. Yeah. yeah man probably on a on a stage very far away from us um, probably as far time. away as they can get yeah us. i think they've probably had words to make the, the distance between our stage and their stage even further apart but yeah 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 we are on the same poster that's it and that's what really matters in today's day and age um, <laughs> apparently so <laughs> that's what it takes to be playing with that band <laughs> to be sure. supporting that band that's you it. need to be somewhere on that poster yeah um, it's that, that, the festival that, that festival lineup is pretty wild it's it's cool that it's back and it's uh it's called it's back with such a such a decent lineup as well um we got into your new album and can't stop listening says henry welcome aboard chuggalo we're glad you're here um now you just go back and listen to the rest of it. Listen to all the old stuff. Keep it on. Uh, keep it on repeat. Keep it on repeat. What's your favorite song from the album? Um, what yeah, else have we got to chat about? Henry, because what's your favorite uh, song? Because because our our plan has gone apart a little bit. Um, what else have so we got? Let's have a look at the notes. Uh, so we've got an out. We've got an announcement coming in the new year. Uh, because Toby's here, I won't actually say what it is. Because I might get in trouble. No. But in the, new year, <laughs> in the new year, we are going to be announcing something. 
We are going to be announcing it early on Patreon. Um, in fact, it's going to be revealed in a podcast on our Patreon um, probably tomorrow if we can get it uploaded then. Um, it is a Christmas episode, so, you know, let's get it up before Christmas. Uh, is, this we, the, uh, is that the uh, um, tumble dryer episode where we talk about our, what, what tumble dryers everyone have, has? Shit. I don't I know. I think that's in there. As a little, you know, a little deal sweetener for anyone thinking about listening to our podcast or signing up for the Patreon. On this episode, we talk about tumble dryers and you can't get better than that. Can't get better than that. Um, so, yes, anyway, uh, we, we, we announce it in the podcast and we follow it up with um, the official Patreon announcement. Announce what, Levi? Uh, the announcement of the thing that we're doing next year. Uh, if you're on Facebook, Toby Toby may have just revealed it in that. Um, but let's leave that as vague as possible. Um, so there we go. How wild Speaking of be? Patreon, um, we've been having some good fun, haven't we? We've been having you know, loads of fun. Schedule permitting. We're on there. Playing games, you know, having a good time, getting dubs, maybe on Warzone. Levi's having a cough. That's fine. <laughs> um, but I'm, yeah, I'm, man, I'm the, quite sick. When we're all together, playing Warzone, Among Us, any other game uh, that allows did, we us. We did Jackbox. We did Jackbox the other day. How was that, man? That was good fun. That was good fun. We uh, there's there's a sort of. Uh, uh, quip plash is what it's called, but it's basically cards again. It's pretty sick. Um, what else have we played? We've played sea, uh, uh, sea of Thieves. We've been playing some Sea of Thieves. Uh, oh, Dead really? by Daylight. Is that, is that on Game Pass? It is on Game Pass. I was looking into getting that man. I might, I might do it now. It, it get, Game Pass is getting sweeter and sweeter, man. Like it's becoming actually quite hard not to get Game Pass. Um, but uh, yeah, we've been playing all sorts with with the with with the gamers in uh, in the Discord, and it's been good fun. So if that tickles your pickle, um, you know, join the Patreon. That doesn't tickle your pickle. There's all sorts of stuff on there. We've got exclusive songs. We've got demo versions of stuff. We've got um, uh, early announcements. We've got the podcast, which we're now uploading semi regularly. Um, and what is it? Also, is it like three pound, three pound fifty gets you on the Discord? I guess you're having a, 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 a rambunctious time, whatever that word right. means. Yep. And then for all the other stuff, there are other tiers. But three pound fifty at least gets you in the club. Um, yeah, man. Gets you gaming. Gets you. Get it. it it's 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 you're paying to have friends, really. At the end of the day, with that one, but um, don't think about that. Because it is a good time. Yeah, it's a, it is genuinely a lot of fun, and and everybody in the Discord is chill as fuck. No, we don't, we don't, we don't fuck around. It's not like we don't bullshit. We call people out if they're being dicks, and uh, no one's a know, dick though, which is good. No one's a dick. That's it. Nobody's a dick, but we wouldn't put up with it if people were. Um, we are, uh, you know, it, it's it's a nice place to be and we absolutely love our patrons they allow us to keep doing this stuff um somebody said to me the other day and i just want to sort of get this out there somebody said to me make it free make the patreon free and if we did we would genuinely lose half of you it's a massive source of <coughs> of income for us and allows us to actually keep everything going and uh we will always appreciate the juggalos for allowing us to keep doing this fucking as toby so eloquently fucking nonsense and uh you know it's good fun it's good fun um there you go like have we have we reached the bottom of the barrel now um if you check the uh the minutes yeah, the, the I, think, I, think, I think we're there we've done it all this is a 50 minute episode of Chugger Vision. And uh, any, any last think... words from anyone watching who still is, who still is watching any, 
any comments any uh further questions I hope you have an amazing christmas we will cover this thank you very much um, that's very kind there is probably not to be too much between now and new year from us on social media however we are always going to be active in the discord on patreon we are going to be uploading some stuff um between now and new year's on there um but is there another just, cover on the way or there is there is another cover on the way yes there is absolutely and um, that's that's going to be uploaded there before anywhere or we'll we'll get that up before new year how about that we'll get that up before that's new year. exciting that's soon that is soon. Um, I mean, it's done. Have All we need to do is upload it. So, you know. Have we got a hint of what, of what that might be? Uh, any kind of little hint that we can... Uh, is, is, is Biggest Toby pop pop band in the world. There you go. And it's not Sugar Boom. And it's not Sugar Boom. Uh, so there you go. Have a wonderful Chugmas, motherfuckers. And an even better new year. Gonna, we're going to be busy next year, everybody. I promise you, Chugga Boom is going to be really fucking busy next year. We're playing. We're going to try and play fucking everywhere. That's the plan. That's the plan. And uh, Toby, if shit, let's have a call soon to get all of this fucking shit knocked out. Merry Chugmas, Casta. Merry Chugmas, Chuggalos. We will Merry see Chugmas you in the everyone. See you in the Discord, patrons. We love you all. Thank you very fucking much. Thank you. Merry Christmas.